let's find the greatest common factor, the GCF for 15 and 18. So for the GCF, sometimes that's called the greatest common divisor or highest common factor. I like greatest common factor. Let's go with that. So what we're going to do, we'll find the factors of 15 and 18, look at the common factors, and then just select the greatest one. That's the GCF. For 15, 1 times 15, that's 15, and 3 times 5, that equals 15. Those are the factors for 15. For 18, we have 1 times 18, 2 times 9, 3 times 6, and that's it. Those are the factors for 18. So now we have all the factors, we can look at the ones in common. Well, 1 goes into 15 evenly, and it goes into 18 evenly. So that's a factor. And then we have 3, that goes into 15 and 18. But those are the only factors for 15 and 18. That makes 3 the greatest common factor, the GCF for 15 and 18. There are other ways you could do this, like prime factorization, and you get the same answer. But it's probably easier to do this way unless you have a really big number. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.